One of the most common questions I get asked is, you know, how do I start day trading? So what me and my mentor Bao did for our viewers on YouTube is create a free mentorship course that reveals our 12 secrets that every single brand new day trader should know before they get started. But please take note that there is limited seating every single week. So please reserve your spot at myinvestingclub.co. Link is in the description. What's up, everyone? It's Tom Dizzo here. Uh, I hope you guys had a great weekend. Also, happy 4th of July. Uh, you know, I hope you guys, uh, you know, enjoying the time, uh, with your family and your loved ones. So yeah, today I'm, uh, I just want to kind of go over, uh, one or two of my trades from last week. So the ticker I traded on Friday, uh, T A T T, uh, you know, this is like pretty straightforward, right? Uh, you know, small caps, uh, if you look on daily, uh it's pretty much you know like a uh like the bin like like the turd or like a bin and down stocks every time it pops you know it gets sold into and as you can see here uh uh maybe uh, let me bring it to like i don't know time frame maybe like five years let's say so you know you can s tell the big picture uh that you know the stock basically when you know this is like only five years to like 12 to like three so every time the stock is popping you know back up to resistance you know fell pop back up fell you know so you know like history repeats itself right this is what we want uh you know like not not probably you know a, a ton of baggies here I mean, since i don't see a volume here but i can clearly tell from the chart that uh you know this is like a a broken kind of chart and it's beaten down and uh, you know like, like every time it gets um uh, it, it pops back into those line uh they're gonna meet seller right so this is like uh the the thesis behind it or like the big uh the like the bigger picture and, uh, <coughs> and uh you know so that that why uh that's uh you know why i was in really interested uh in that one and uh and you know pretty much uh uh after hours it ran some sort of news i can't remember what that was but uh you know basically it went from six to like you know almost like 10 uh after hours right in the pre-market you know kind of i went down a little bit here at four five a.m six seven a.m uh so to me the top is pretty much set the top is temporarily set at 10 10 20 or whatever uh you want to call it uh so you know uh, and on this type of stock is really what I'm looking for, right? So I want to, you know, as a short seller, I want to top to be put in first <coughs> before I looking into uh, uh, to shorting the pops, right? Uh, and you know, so all the all my criteria, uh, like criteria, uh, were kind of lining up on this one. So I waited for the open, okay, and. Uh, what it is was maybe like this okay so let's say you're gonna your max loss is around like thousand bucks right so theoretically uh it's you know let's say you're gonna get in at 10 right 1000 shares full size right like your max risk is like uh no uh let me just put on here maybe 500 bucks thousand is too much 500 bucks right so let's say you're gonna get here get in here 1,000 shares right and you're gonna risk uh, all the way to that 1050 which is uh, you know 500 bucks and you know there is really nothing like that this is really not nothing wrong with it or maybe this is more like a, a better example here let's see like you want to chase the stock okay not scaling but chasing the stock okay so like let's say here at 950 uh when it start doing this tank right you want to get in here at uh, uh 1000 and risking here you know, 1050 this is like where the thesis is, is is valid right uh uh and you know your max size is is uh basically 1000 uh you know shares but since you chasing in this here 950 
you know, like for you to be able to sustain that move, 1050 is a good line to stop, right? But then another 110 here, like if you are getting yourself, like a lot of times is, you know, let's say your max loss is 500 bucks, right? And you either gonna get in like the full size here, uh, a 1000 shares and risking only 10 here, which is a 500 bucks, right? This is, you know, I would say it is more like a tight risk kind of trade. Instead of if you risking here a thousand bucks, that's too much for you, right? Because since your max loss is 500 bucks, you're getting here with 1000 shares, you're risking only 10, 500 bucks. That's correct, right? Because that's the max that you are willing to lose. But if you are doing that, right? Because the stop is so tight and also the thesis is still valid, even if it breaks 10, likely the odds are not going to be in your favor, right? Like you would be more stressful of every single tick because of that size that you're using, right? And one of, well, so that's why we suggest, you know, our members to kind of scale into that. So, uh, you know, what, what is the best kind of way how to kind of approach it is let's say 1050, 1051. This is like the ultimate stop. This is like, you know, where this is no longer valid. Yes. So, and your max size is, you know, like 500 and, you know, like a thousand shares based on that 500 and, you know, max loss. So you could get in here with 950 not with the whole 1000 shares, right? Because if you're getting 1000 shares here, then your stop has to be over that 10, which is 500 bucks, right? So instead of that 1000 shares you want, you, you want to get in, get in with just 500 because 500, right? When it hits into this 1050, yes, it's going to hit your max loss, but you have more room for the stock to like, to let the stock work for you, which is going to reduce the stress which is, you know, the odds are going to be in your favor. Thank you so much for watching our video. If you want to see more of our videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the button here. We do our best to post a new video every single day. If you have any questions about MIC or any general trading questions, please text Tosh using the number here. Also, stay up to date by watching some of our most recent videos right over here.